Hey guys, Ali here, hope you're all well and welcome to the channel. In today's video, I'm gonna try a 24 karat gold burger. Now this is from a joint in Bradford called Burgery, Burgery, Bur look, I can't pronounce it. I'm gonna put it on the screen somewhere. I don't know how to say it. That's where I'm going. They've kindly invited me down. They've asked me to check it out and just let them know what I think. So I thought, you know what? Let's bring the camera and let's do a review. I have never had gold in a burger. It's a little bit of luxury. It's a little bit of luxury in something that I already enjoy burgers. So I thought, why not? Let's check it out. It's super different. Hoping it tastes fantastic as well. So let's make our way there now and let's start that review. Right, here we go. So this is the place I'm going to. They've got the golden burger. Cannot wait, cannot wait to try. Okay guys, so I'm inside. I'm gonna order my food. I'm pretty sure I know what I'm gonna get. So I'm gonna get the burger that I just mentioned. I'll probably get a chicken burger. I'll probably get a couple of slides as well. They've got a really good looking menu. So I think I'm just looking at it whilst I'm talking to you guys. So they've got a section for wings. I think I'll get a portion of wings. Of Sriracha honey, sriracha honey, that sounds delicious. A bit of spice, a bit of sweetness, but I'm definitely gonna get that gold burger as well, guys. So let me place that order now. As soon as the food comes out, we'll start the review. All right, guys, so I've asked for all the food to be given in the takeaway bag. I've asked for the food to be packed and served, etc. Exactly the same way it would be to anyone else. So if you were coming here, then you kind of know exactly what you're getting if I show it up here. So. So I have actually gone for a normal smash burger. I will be getting, obviously, the gold burger, but because I imagine you're not gonna be getting every time. Smash burgers, I think, is something that I should cover. They have a hot chicken sandwich. Oh, okay. This, this has gotta be the gold one, right? Look at that. I, I know it's only gold foil, but I'm on such a hype that I, I, I'm sold already, I'm sold already. <laughs> and then we've gone for some wings. These are chipotle honey. Let's have a look. Oh, no, sorry, these are sriracha honey. I do beg your pardon, but these look, oh. These look good. So let's try the hot chicken first because I like spicy chicken sandwiches. That's just what I think of. When I see hot chicken, I just see spicy chicken burgers. So if cameraman can actually come down here, let's unwrap this. I just, I like the actual packaging, it's nice. Let's give it a go. Ooh. I can show you that, guys. Crispness on that it looks good. It's dip in their own sauce. It looks good. Let's try this. Essentially, you've got a piece of chicken, coated, fried, dipped in their own spicy sauce. This looks good. Let's give it a go. It just has a more premium feel to it. Really good crispness actually on the batter. I think that's important. There's a good amount of spice going on there. There's a good amount of chicken going on there. I like the kick. There's a good kick to that. It's sort of settling in as I'm talking. I could just demolish three of these easily. Super tasty. But what I'm gonna do now, guys, I'm gonna probably go for another few bites of this, but we're gonna move on to the gold burger because that's what we're here for. I was just super excited to do this as well. That's definitely the most premium sort of luxury spicy chicken burger I've had in Bradford. Let's now go for the gold one, right? Let's try this. So if cameraman can come down here and let's show this bad boy off. This one's called the burger, which I find interesting. Let's go inside. Ooh, it's got a black charcoal bun. That's interesting. There's a couple of Wagyu beef patties in there rather than the uh, normal beef, which they have, which I think is Angus. If I can just open that a little bit, that's actually 24 karat cheese. Uh, sorry, 24 karat gold cheese, which have you ever seen that in a burger? I haven't. That is super unique. Look at the caramelization on these buns, actually. Sorry, I'm losing my words because this is so nice. Look at the caramelization on these patties. Looks fantastic. Guys, is this not literally the definition of luxury? You've got two Wagyu patties in there, which if you haven't tried Wagyu before, try it, it will change your life. And you've got gold in there. You've got some gold cheese sauce, you've got some gold cheese. This looks absolutely fantastic. Yep. That's the best burger in Bradford. That is just, the Wagyu beef has got such a beautiful taste to it. Seasoning on point. 
It's got a really nice fattiness to it that, for example, like Aberdeen Angus, which is delicious in itself, Wagyu just takes it honestly to a whole nother level. The taste is so unique. Great amount of fat to meat ratio there. There's a good amount of cheese in there. I'm liking actually the gold sauce they've got in there too. The gold, it just adds like luxury. It just adds like premiumness. Do you know what I mean? Oh, this is so unique. This is so unique. The bun is actually black because it's a charcoal bun, which again, just takes the luxury to a whole nother level. But honestly, man, those patties, even if the gold wasn't there, that is the best burger in Bradford, easily. This, guys, is getting a massive, massive hay man. Guys, the gold sauce, the cheese, the actual patties, like the acidity from the red onions, the charcoal bun, like this is just, just a feat of architecture. Each layer is, is absolutely fantastic. I'd implore you guys to just check this out. It's a bit fancy, it's a bit different. Pricey, yes, but I think you get back what you pay. This for me is the best burger in Bradford. However, however, what I am gonna do guys, I'm also gonna try their regular smash patty burger, which is like half the price, doesn't have the gold in it. This is Aberdeen Angus, which is a very high quality meat in itself, right? So let's try now the smash patty burger. The camera I can just come down and show people in real time what I'm doing. So that's the big one, I think it's 6.95 which obviously is like less than half the price, but honestly, they've nailed the caramelization again on these smash patties. They've got a couple in there. You've got some, uh, obviously some, some gurk in there. You've got some onion, good amount of cheese. No tomato, happy with that. That's already a win. Looks wise, guys, this looks, just looks really, really good. This would be, I don't know, a good like tenner in Manchester. I think priced really competitively. I'm looking forward to just tucking into this bad boy. Oh if the burger, the gold one, is the best burger in Bradford, this is the second best because it is absolutely delicious. You know what this is getting, guys? This is getting a hey man, honestly. Just they've, they've nailed it, they've actually nailed it. I think pricing on this is really good. I think the burger itself, I'm looking at the menu, is $6.95 and you can make something a meal by adding $2.95. So I think you'd get, I can't read it from here, I'll put it in the menu, maybe chips and a drink. But that is absolutely delicious. Manchester, I would say, has got a much better smash patty burger scene, but this could 100% compete with that. This is the best one I've had in Bradford, apart from the other one, the other one that they do, so these two together, right? You'd get this if you want something a bit of fancy, you want to impress someone, if you want to try something new, you haven't had Wagyu before, 100% get that. On like a regular day, get this one. Sake, no one? Yeah. <laughs> I'm not sure if you guys heard that. Camera man. You're a suck in there. Basically, start breathe because I'm so excited. Well, excited. I talk a lot. I ramble, but this is delicious, man. This gets a hey, man. The meat is flavored unbelievably. There's no tomato in there, which automatically means it's halfway to a hey, man. It gets a hey. Look already, just because there's no tomato. <laughs> I would go for the gold one for once, just because it's wagyu. You've not had it before, but this as well, highly, 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 highly recommend. I want everyone to try this. But before you guys go, because you're thinking, do you know what, Ali's given us the burger review. He's told us about the gold burger. Let's now switch off. You can't switch off, and I'll tell you why. They've actually got some sriracha honey wings, which sounds like an amazing flavor combination. Something spicy, something sweet, combined sounds really, really good. Let me just tuck into those before you go. These look amazing. They've got some like proper color to them, which I love. Look how they coated well. Just a bit extra fancy fancy. It's a little bit of like sesame seeds are sprinkled on there as well. These are really saucy. So it's a good thing they give me a load of tissues. I'm messy at the best of times. So let's try this. It looks, it looks fantastic. Flavor profile, unreal. When you bite into it, you get a shot of spice. That's the sriracha. As you chew, you get like an underlayer of sweetness. That's the honey. Then they combine as you eat, and the aftertaste is phenomenal. Good kick, but sweetness to it. If they can focus on the batter and make that a bit crunchier when it's coated, when the sauce is, when the wings actually dip, the wing has a bit of crunch, and that'll make it a hay man. As it stands, it's a very good wing. The flavor combination is, is unreal. Would I get them again? Yeah. I'd probably get them every single time I came. I'd get them with the burger. But if they could improve on that, it'd be a 10 out of 10 because the flavor on that is like unreal. As soon as it hits your tongue, you're in for a good time. Guys, I'm gonna spice this in, right? Because the camera's there, but cameraman thought he was gonna eat without it being on the camera. Let's see what cameraman's saying. Like baby now. 
Oh, that's spicy. Good amount of spice, but what do you think? Yeah. Mm. There is a good amount of spice, isn't there? Definitely agree, it needs a little bit more of a crunch, but flavor wise, very good, very meaty, and very soft as well. I agree. Okay, so I've also got some skin on fries. Something I did in a recent video, and I, I actually, it, it, it's annoying me that I can't remember which video. I did a review where they had a pot of uh, nacho cheese, which I think is like, oh, it's such a good, it's just a good thing to have with a meal. You can dip your chips in. Oh, amazing. They do that here. Oh, for the I'm life of me. Sorry? Is I'm with you? You may have been with me. It was like a takeaway, and they did like a, literally a pot like this of nacho cheese, and I loved it. It's not legend, legend, is it? Was that Legends, guys? Okay, if you guys watch all my videos, which you should be, you will know which video it is. I genuinely don't remember, but needless to say, I just think it's it's awesome to do that. They do that here, so let's dip some of these little chippy poos. And that is why I love cheese sauce. It's so good. Guys, you'll notice the quality and the sound is a little bit different on this segment. I have some spicy food, so I thought, you know what, they do shakes here, let's try the shakes as well. This is the Biscoff shake, so I thought I'd give it a go. Like I said, I'm just sliding this into the video, record it on a camera, also record it on a phone, so apologies for the quality, and probably the dodgy sound. I needed that, because the wings were super spicy, super flavorful, but I needed a milkshake just to pull my mouth down. Biscoff, where have you been all my life? Last couple of years have become popular. The best milkshake flavor, hands down. Right, so being a little bit naughty, doing final thoughts outside, but haven't actually finished my meal. Taz is still inside, that's why I stupidly am not wearing my hoodie. So I'm gonna go back inside. But guys, I just, I'm just excited just to ramble about this place. Oh, first time I went there, absolutely amazing. I love the gold burger. I love the Wagyu patties. I love the smash patty burger. I love the uh, normal, the actual smash. Did I just say that? I just said that. <laughs> I'm really excited, guys. So tripping over my words. So yeah, I enjoyed everything. I even like the spicy chicken burger. I think that's one of their better sellers. But honestly, for me, if I was going, I think it just depends what you like if you're a chicken fan or a beef fan. I always pick chicken. The reason why I picked that is because beef is quite hard to do. When beef is done well, I always, always go for beef. Here, go for beef. Go for the gold one and the smash patty burger and the wings, delicious. But anyway, guys, I'm actually gonna run back inside. I'm gonna finish my meals. So uh, if you like this video, make sure to drop the video a like, helps with exposure on YouTube. If you wanna see more videos in Bradford, let me know where I should go next in the comments and make sure you subscribe. But I'll see you guys in that next video. Bye, 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 bye.